वेलकम व्यूअर्स दिस इज ग्रीन गाय टैरो एंड दिस इज योर वट्स नेक्स्ट इन लाइफ दिस इज अ रीडिंग दैट इज मेंट फॉर नेक्स्ट थ्री मंथ्स वेन एवर यू कम अक्रॉस दिस रीडिंग दिस कैन बी टूडे और दिस कैन डेफिनेटली बी थ्री मंथ्स फ्रॉम नाउ और थ्री ईयर्स फ्रॉम नाउ वेन एवर यू कम अक्रॉस दिस रीडिंग दिस रीडिंग इज फॉर नेक्स्ट थ्री मंथ्स what is coming in your life next so take a deep breath think about your option select it and we will start the reading from pile number 1 welcome pile number 1 this is your what's next in life pick a card reading this is a reading for 3 months span let's see within the next 3 months what's coming into your life At first, we will see the tarot. Then we will follow your oracle cards. Okay. Your first card is the hierophant. Next, you have the six of wands. Then you have eight of cups. Next, you have ten of cups. and then you have the fool card okay pile number 1 things are looking pretty good for you in next 3 months that i can tell you right away because your first card is the hierophant the major arcana and the last card is the fool the major arcana so the hierophant tells me that there will be commitment if this is a relationship that is coming for your life definitely there will be a committed relationship it can definitely be something official for you if this is a job offer definitely this is going to be a very serious and some sort of government related job you can definitely be in a position of finding yourself teaching other people or that can be also a job offer for you this also indicates about you finding an opportunity of higher studies or higher knowledge or definitely your spiritual growth whatever it is that is coming your in your life this is something big and very prominent and it is a very life changing event for you the very next card is a six of wands the victory card the setting examples card people will honor you look up to you and appreciate your accomplishment so definitely this is something big that is going to bring you honor abundance and prosperity and growth the next card is the 8 of cups this is the card that tells me that you are changing yourself your ways of working or your situation in relations you are cutting cords with old toxic situation that no longer is needed in your life this is a path of freedom to your self growth that you are selecting with this 8 of cups and this is a very enlightening for you also the next card is the 10 of cups this is the card of ultimate sorry ultimate abundance prosperity togetherness love family bonding and good times there will be news of childbirth also included because this is a complete package of good things that what is the 10 of cups so if you are looking for stability in wealth that is also indicated if you are looking for relationship that can definitely give you your heart's contentment 
definitely it is indicated and good and happy times with your family is also there so that's really beautiful pile number one the next and final card for you is the fool card this is the card that tells about you venturing out with new opportunities and this is the beginning of a new chapter in your life you are blessed you are heading forward and there is no stopping you so pile number one your next three months are looking really good strong and abundant let's see what we have for you in the oracle cards your first card says sometimes the good is hidden so if you haven't seen all these magics yet to shining in to your life you will in divine timing i know divine timing is not a very good phrase for everyone because it is something that requires your patience and persistence and not many of us are comfortable with the waiting period but your waiting period is almost over because life is bringing you so much you just have to wait a little until it arrives it's like you ordering a package and it is shipped it is on the way it is coming you have done lots of hard work and the results are coming because the very next card for you is believing in magic true magic is abandoning in my life you have to have this affirmation inside your heart and mind true magic is abandoning in my life the magic is coming towards you it is going to happen it is happening it's better say you have to have this energy inside you to speed up your manifestations it is happening the abundance is happening in my life have this inside you and this will definitely come sooner because you got the miracles card also expect wonders to emerge so there will be big and beautiful changes in your life that you didn't thought of and it is coming it is coming it is coming big time you can see the magic lamp magic lamp always wishes three sorry grants three wishes so there might be three things that is coming big time for you you have the star in the image also that definitely indicates about wish fulfillment and the moon is telling me that this can definitely be something very close to your heart and in your creative worlds if not you just have to wait a little more and it will be soon enough your final card is be assertive this is the card that is telling me that you just need to have the positive energy inside you the faith and believe inside you and the openness to receive the abundance the magic the miracles in your life don't resist any change grow with them and find your miracles so pile number 1 this was your what's next in life pick a card reading for next 3 months if you like my reading please hit the like button don't forget to share subscribe and comment thank you very much for your participation have a great day welcome pile number 2 this is your what's next in life pick a card reading let's see what it is that is coming from the tarot first then we will follow your oracle cards 
Pile number two, your first card is seven of coins. Next you have the knight of coins. Then you have the knight of cups. Then you have the two of coins. And the final card is the queen of cups. So, pile number two. Your first card is the seven of coins. This is the card that tells me that you have done the hard work and you are waiting for results and it is right around the corner it is coming you don't have to wait much longer but having patience is something that is really required from you and patience with positivity just don't feel so disheartened or it's not gonna turn out good or any kind of lack mentality don't encourage those thoughts inside you. Be assertive. Be open. The next card is the eight, sorry, is the knight of coins. This is the card that tells about you being determined to achieve your goals, planning and strategizing and taking your sweet time to do so. You are not rushing. Again, this is an energy that tells me that definitely there will be results but there is a waiting period that you need to be over with with a very positive attitude and meanwhile when you are waiting you need to plan or prepare for better outcomes of yours. So that when the results comes, you just won't be celebrating. You will celebrate, but you will utilize that success in your life more. And that is the preparation that you need to do while you are waiting. The next card is the Knight of Cups. This is the card that tells me as you succeed, there will be offers coming in your way that can definitely be an offer of something that is creative or your creative project will find uh, an offer that is very generous and suitable for your efforts or this can be something related to your heart this can definitely be the love offer that you have been waiting for so long now and it is here. This can also be an offer that will give you a chance to shine better and brighter in your future. So be mindful of that. The next card is the two of pentacles. This is the card that tells about you planning and visualizing your future or your better future ahead of you you are being prepared you are planning you are strategizing everything step by step towards your required or desired goals in your life so you are very much sorted in this spread of cards that I can see you are well-rounded person there is no cutting corners and there is no lack of effort to be the victorious one that you want to the next card is the Queen of Cups this is the card that tells me that you are going to find your heart's desire. This can definitely be you finding a very abundant offer in your creative project or creativity that is going to shine to the world. This can also be something in your work where you will be the 
person who will bring good luck and good fortune with their new ideas that will definitely impress and impress everyone and let them or lead them better towards the success that this project is meant for this is the card that also tells me that you are going to be someone who is very much able and abundant to fulfill their responsibilities and you are going to take care of everyone this also indicates you finding a wonderful partner who can have the feminine energy beautifully they can definitely be beautiful in every aspect of their being and they will definitely be someone who is very empowered also so pile number 2 this is what i have for you in the tarot for your what's next in life let's see what we have for you in the oracle cards your first cards in the oracles are time for a love feast yes as i was telling you the queen of cups is here love will be there love is never in vain so definitely if you are waiting for this with that seven of coin this is definitely coming and you don't have to be disheartened at any point of time love was there love still is there and will be there let's see what we have next for you the next card you've got two cards and again two cards you've got so many extra cards igniting courage i'm strong valiant and courageous yes you need to move forward you need to remain strong valiant and courageous things will work out things will work out for good you don't have to worry you just have to have the faith inside you upon the divine and confidence in your abilities the next card for you is hearing messages from spirit i am a clear channel for messages from spirit so there will be guidance from your angels for you either you're going to see or better say you're going to hear the messages directly or feel the ideas coming into you or there will be omens happening around you that will indicate the message that you need to understand or this can also be messages from someone that you have been waiting for long next you have unknown territory you are exactly where you need to be so definitely you are moving forward and it is not possible for you to know every corner that you are going to be but you have to have the faith that you are exactly where you needed to be so you will be at the right place at the right time that is a very positive sign for you you are going to find yourself being the wise one at the right time at the needed time that's really very assuring the next card is infinite abundance abundance is pouring into your life so there will be abundance of love abundance of wealth and knowledge definitely coming into your life you don't have to worry pile number 2 things are looking really good the final message for you is communicate clearly this is the message that tells me that all you need is clear communication when you have the clear communication with yourself with your spirit guides and angels you know what you want and you convey that message to the universe and you get your wishes by the blessings of the universe 
same if you want something you have to convey the message to other people what you exactly want if they understand your point if they understand your views they will appreciate what you are asking or saying to them so pile number 2 this was your what's next in life pick a card reading if you like my reading please hit the like button don't forget to share subscribe and comment thank you very much for your participation have a great day welcome pile number 3 this is your what's next in life pick a card reading we will see first the tarot then we will see the oracle cards pile number 3 your first card is knight of wands next you have the seven of swords then you have the world card next you have the ace of swords next you have the five of cups okay pile number 3 your first card is knight of wands this is the card that tells about the passionate energy that doesn't have persistence so this is the energy of someone about something that it's on again off again kind of an approach so if this is you who are very enthusiastic in the beginning of the week but by the end of the week you lost that passion you need to have persistence regarding whatever you are doing or want to do or want to pursue because if you lose the energy how you going to work on it or convince or show everyone that how important it is so be mindful of that energy and if this is not you you need to be alert of this person who is definitely lacking a balance energy the next card is the 7 of swords this is the clear card of sabotage this can definitely be sabotage by other people so you need to be mindful of that that there will be people or a person who can rain rain on your parade because they have their own hidden agendas of being around you or if this is you you need to let go of any sort of lack mentality that you are not good enough to pursue something to have something this is what is coming and this is something that might end a situation in your life either you are letting go of a person or peoples from your life and moving on from the toxic energies or if this is you you are changing yourself and learning better and sorry and learning to become the better self of yours and growing into a in a growing into a matured self of yours who can achieve anything that they wish because the next card for you is the world card this is the card that tells about a major change that is going to bring you abundance prosperity and good fortune pardon me for the noise so this new beginning is definitely something that will give you the empowered energy that you need to feel you are getting out of that seven of swords energy and you are moving forward towards this ace of swords there will be new beginning knowledge abundance prosperity coming your way with these two cards coming back to back the world card the ace of swords this is the assurance from the universe that when you are ending that lack mentality or the sabotage energy you are releasing from your life 
you are going forward towards a better and brighter future of yours and that is something that you need to follow the final card is the five of cups this is the card that again shares an energy of you not appreciating what you have in your life this can definitely be the energy of you having a sad nostalgia that is keeping you stuck in the past something was lost taken away from you or just wasn't good enough as per your expectations and you are not letting that go you are stuck in that energy and it is the energy that is resisting you or that is lingering in your life and stopping you from enjoying the two of cups that you have in your life it is already gone with the past but you are not letting it go if you let that go you will see what you have in your life and you will feel the energy of love and appreciation and you will attract more love and appreciation and abundance in your life so it is up to you to choose which way you want to go so pile number 3 this was the tarot for you let's see what we have for you in the oracle cards enjoy your extraordinary uniqueness so you need to appreciate the amazing being that you are who is created by the universe you are unique no matter who appreciates it or not you must appreciate yourself and you must enjoy your uniqueness the next card for you is accepting what is i accept and embrace my inner majesty again another card that is telling you to embrace yourself you have what it takes inside you you are a blessed child of the universe and things will definitely work out for you you have to have that inside you you are a magical being if you don't believe that how you are going to act upon it how you are going to manifest what you want how you are going to work harder for your desired wish or dreams because if you don't appreciate yourself you won't find the right energies inside you to push forward push harder to achieve all that you want you need to have that inside you the next card for you is far away places get ready for new horizons so this is the card that tells me that it is the time for you to explore new places that can definitely be a foreign land or a new project that is a different sort of project that you do usually this is something new and you need to be prepared for that yes change is uncomfortable it will take you out of your comfort zone but it is for your growth and your better future and you need to understand that the next card for you is wait so you don't need to rush you just have to breathe relax and go with the flow you need to wait and you need to believe if you believe this is the card that sums up your reading you need to believe 
that you can do it. You can achieve all that you desire. You have it in you. And before anyone else, you have to believe that. Until and unless you believe it, you won't be able to make anyone else understand it. So pile number three, this was your what's next in life pick a card reading. If you like my reading, please hit the like button. Don't forget to share, subscribe and comment. Thank you very much for your participation. Have a great day. So viewers, this was your what's next in life for next three months pick a card reading. If you like my reading, please hit the like button. Don't forget to share, subscribe and comment. Thank you very much for your participation. Have a great day.